So how do solar tiles compare to solar panels? I'm going to look at the specs of both and compare them all, as well as the costs and any other features that should be pointed out. We'll start by looking at the technology itself. When it comes to efficiency, most solar panels are between 21.5% and 23.5% efficient. Now remember that efficiency is measured in terms of the whole panel, not just the part of the panel that is able to generate electricity. There's a solar tile from a brand called Soltec that claims to have an efficiency of 22.8%. However, it does look to be more just like a small solar panel instead of a solar tile that's made to resemble a natural slate. Tesla also makes a solar tile, however, they've actually never commented on the efficiency of it. We expect that it's between 14 and 18%. The sort of British Tesla equivalent is from a brand called Seleco, and their tile has an efficiency of 17.39%. We estimate that this is similar for company GB Soul and that the average solar tile will have an efficiency between 14 and 19%. So what about output? Well, when it comes to output per square meter, solar tiles from British brand GB Sol would need about 28 square meters to achieve a four kilowatt system. With Seleco's tiles, you'd need about 27 square meters. However, to get the equivalent four kilowatt peak using solar panels, you'd only need about 18 square meters if you're using modern 450 watt panels. Modern solar panels are about 1.99 square meters at the moment. With solar tiles, you can of course use the tight corners on the roof, as well as the edges, which does allow you to make the most of your roof space, which you obviously can't do with conventional solar panels. When it comes to warranty, solar tiles are actually very good. And the British company GB Sol offers a 25 year product performance and weatherproofing warranty. Their performance warranty guarantees that 90% of the original generation capacity will still be there after 10 years, and that 80% of it will still be there after 25 years. And this is decent compared to solar panels. The JA440 watt panel, which is one of the best sellers in the UK, offers only a 12 year product warranty. However, it does have a 25 year performance warranty. And this basically says that the panel will still be generating around 83% of its original capacity after 25 years. Now there are obviously more premium panels like the REC Alpha Pure 430 watt, which will have a 92% power output after 25 years, which is obviously far better than solar tiles. Now, it wouldn't be a fair comparison without mentioning the price. And the short answer is that solar tiles cost around three or four times as much as solar panels do. When installing 10 kilowatts in roof as part of a new build, you're looking at around 10 grand, whereas the equivalent system would be in the region of 30 grand for solar tiles. I should also mention that if installed as part of a new build project, installing solar panels will save a lot of money on roof tiles. Solar tiles will obviously do the same, however they're still very expensive, whereas solar panels are a lot cheaper than roof tiles. So it's cheaper to just cover your roof in solar panels and you'll also get a return on your investment. Aesthetically, solar tiles are just far better looking. Some of them, such as the GB Soul PV Slate, do actually look exactly like real slate tiles and you can't tell the difference. They're actually designed to be interlaced with real slate tiles and using GB Soul system, you can have the generating PV slates on the good roof faces and then dummy slate tiles on say the north face or any roof areas that are shaded. The best looking PV system that you'll ever see is an in-roof system with all black solar panels on a slate tile backdrop. And our head of sales actually has this installed on his roof. Ultimately, solar tile technology just isn't well developed enough at the moment. And we'd only recommend solar tiles for buildings where the aesthetics are gonna make or break the project. For example, if you have a listed building. Otherwise, I'd just go for a sleek in-roof system. If you'd like to learn more about solar tiles, please see our other videos in this series or take a look at our YouTube and website to learn more about all things solar and battery. We also have a great knowledge bank page on solar tiles that you can read if you'd like to learn more.